I am taking LSD. No, it is not lysergic acid diethylamide. It is not the psychedelic drug of 60s. It is long, slow, deep breathing. L S D does wonders. So it started back in my personal training days about five years ago for my clients whom I would have just trained and after a workout, I will get them to do some stretches. And accidentally during those times, I coined this long, slow, deep breathing. After finishing a workout, your heart rate is up, your uh, sympathetic system is all turned on and you can't go out of the gym in that state. And as we know, static stretching is overall good for you. When I was giving those stretches to my clients, I would say, don't worry about stretching too much. Instead, focus on your breathing. And long, slow and deep was invented. It is not a meditation practice. It is just a simple method in which you can breathe long, slow and deep. There is no need to make or hold the breath at any point. There is no need to rise your chest or push your belly out for this breathing. All you have to do is breathe through your nose with your lips closed and focus on saying this to in your mind. Long, slow, deep. LSD. You can be almost in any position. I prefer to be in a position like this or at least where my back is not touching anything. So my back has to be erect. This is not yoga. This is not meditation. It has proven to be having a lot of beneficial uh, effects and it is very simple. It happened to me as an accident like I mentioned that taking long, slow, deep breath makes you recover from your workouts. I also do it in between my heavy sets of squats and deadlifts. It really rejuvenates me. I just stand there against the bar and just take LSD. There is no warning as such. If you have any uh, breathing troubles, any respiratory illness, Maybe it's best not to do it. But breathing is the most basic thing that we always do. And I always think of things which are simple and reasonable and hence sustainable. And why not breathing? If you're watching this video, you are breathing. It applies to everyone. Breathing is the most simplest of things that we have to do, we must do. So my idea is to how and why not include, inculcate that habit in us of any type of breathing technique. There are many breathing techniques out there. I have done many of them. Anulom, Vilom, Sudarshan breathing, uh, Bhastrika breathing, Kapal Bhati. But this one is different because I just did it almost by accident for relaxing my clients and I do it myself just to relax myself especially in between the sets the heavy sets long slow deep thank you